Thanks for joining us on HTSN. I'm Storm Team 6 meteorologist Kyle Mounts. Hopefully able to dodge some of those raindrops we had on our Saturday. And the rain really kind of fading as it moved from west to east around Lafayette, Terre Haute, picking up about a third of an inch, less than a tenth, though, at the Indy Airport. Tonight we're going to stay with the clouds. Temperatures remaining mild, but I think a dry forecast can't entirely rule out a stray shower or storm for the northern third of the state. Dropping down to 73 for an overnight low in Peru, 72 in Indianapolis, and 73 blooming into Columbus by your Sunday morning, and we'll see a return chance for showers and storms in our Sunday forecast. Here's 7 a.m. You see a couple spotty showers, nothing widespread to start off the day, and that's kind of the way it'll go through the first half of your Sunday with occasional showers here and there. Then, as we go into the afternoon, we'll get a little bit of that daytime heating and destabilize the atmosphere a little bit. And by 4 o'clock, around I 70 and areas to the south, that's where we could see some storms that have a little bit of a punch to them, mainly for some gusty winds. And and this will slide off to the south as we go to 9 o'clock. So we lose the daytime heating and the shower activity should really wind down. But we do have a slight risk of severe storms from Lafayette to Peru and everyone else across central Indiana for our Sunday. Again, the main threat going to be wind that we'll watch. Also some heavy downpours. Any of these storms, of course, would have lightning with them. And then tornado hail, that would be on the low isolated side of threats. Temperatures for Sunday afternoon really going to determine whether you have rain in the afternoon. 84 in Indianapolis could get as warm as 88 in Columbus if you can hold off that rain a little bit. 82 in Muncie and 79 in Peru. Then on Monday, we'll start off things dry. Then as a reinforcing cold front moves through, some scattered showers into the evening hours, and then that will start to taper off as well. But here's that cold front Monday afternoon that's going to swing through, and really the bigger factor with this is going to be kicking out the warm temperatures and bringing in unseasonably cool air for much of the upcoming week. So let's put it together in your seven day planning forecast. Scattered showers and storms Sunday. Just a few evening showers on Monday, a high of 82. We'll drop about 10 degrees for our high by Tuesday afternoon to 72. You notice Tuesday and Wednesday mornings, even into Thursday morning. We're starting off in the 50s, highs in the afternoon into the 70s. Average high is 85. We get closer to average as we look to next weekend.